Hi, my name's Luda. You may recognize me from the forums, and I am going to attempt to um, show you how to use the Odom file to be able to Odin onto your phone CWM, which also stands for Clockwork Mods. Now, um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to try and walk you through this, uh, the, um, the, the steps to um, install CWM onto your phone, and uh, from there you can do a great many other mods. You can uh, update your baseband, you could um, uh, you could put on a custom ROM, uh, you could put a, you know, a custom kernel, which allow you to overclock or you know, do other other things. Um, but uh, CWM is a very important tool. What it is, like I said, it's Clockwork Mods, and it is for um, restoring and backing up uh, your, your your files. So let's uh, let's get started. All right. Um, so I'm going to go to the web pages. Now this is the um, the forum topic that Bad Sector, you see him right here, um, posted to allow us to. Um, sorry, I know I say um a lot. Uh, he posted to allow us to use Odin, uh, and they got this working. You know, it was a uh, Hork 13 Interdepth Penguin Repair. Um, Kid Dynamite also helped with testing, and uh, a lot of people went into making of this. So, uh, props to them. I'm just doing a video based on their work. It's really nothing about me. So. Um, what we got? Samsung. Oh, by the way, please donate. If you have the money to do so, these guys are, are, are working for absolutely nothing. So, um, if you have the time, if you have the money, please give what you can. Thank you. Um, all right, so to start off, first we need the drivers. Now, Bad Sector and his infinite wisdom decided not to give you a direct link to where the drivers are, but he gave you a hint and listed them on his page. Now, you can get those from the Samsung. It's my roommate. Uh, you can get those from Samsung um, on their website, or you can just go to Bad Sector's Minus page and do a search for them. Now I did, and I removed the exact link so that you can't find them yourself. <laughs> That's Ross. Um, so you can't find the direct link from my URL right up here, just because, like I said, it was Bad, bad, bad Sector's uh, decision, and I'm going to go with it. So uh, go ahead and click download once you find those. Like I said, once again, you can get those from the Samsung website. I provide the link myself. Um, on a different forum topic. I'm not exactly sure where. Um, hopefully I'll be able to organize this in such a way that'll be easy for people to find um, on you know a separate forum page. So alright so we got the Samsung drivers as number one right? Number two we need um, the TUCWM recovery tar cwmrecovery.tar is an image that you're going to flash onto your phone with Odin. That is not something you can use that I know of with CWM. Uh, but then again, you really wouldn't be using CWM to uh, flash CWM onto your phone, would you? All right. Next, we have transformultra.ops. Now, what this does is it allows your Odin program to understand where to put files onto your phone. It's, it's kind of like a directory. Um, and this was done through trial and error. The people bricked many a phone trying to find out this information for us, so props to them once again. Uh, and now I'm going to go back to this page because apparently I didn't have the last file up, which is the Odin Multi Downloader version 4.43. Bad Sector, once again, thank you, has um, left us a link where we can download that from his minus page. And here it is. Uh, click the download link, click the exe, whatever you got to do get it downloaded. All right. Now, uh, went ahead and put all these files into a separate folder, the Odin tutorial folder. All right. Now, I've, I've never actually done this, so uh, you'll be learning with me. All right. So, what do we got? First, we got to take our phones, put them into download mode. Now, I'm going to unplug my phone, and I'm going to turn it off. Power off. Okay. We we'll wait for it. All right. I'm going to put it in the download mode by holding down the volume down button, the camera button, and the power button. Just as soon as it turns off. So, how about them Yankees? There we go. All right. Holding down all three buttons, the three-finger salute, as Bad Sector said. 
Download mode. Hmm, a custom OS can cause critical problems in phone and installed applications. If you want to download a custom OS, press the volume up key. Otherwise, press the volume down key to cancel. I'm going to press the volume up key and possibly break my phone. All right, we are in download mode. I'm going to plug my phone into my computer. And installing driver device software. I've already installed these uh, these drivers. My apologies. That's something you should do before you plug in your phone, or even perhaps during. But go ahead and do it before, just just in case. All right. So let's go back to the page and follow his instructions. All right. I know it may be a bit confusing because it has a lot of colored text and other things, but so far we put our phone at the download mode by holding down volume down plus camera, plus power, buttons all at the same time. And it's the three finger salute. Um, you should now see this warning. And that sector has already done it. Fortunately, the only access to the internet I have is my phone. So um, I won't be opening that up for you to see. OK, now hit the volume up button on the Ultra. That put us into download mode. Plug your phone into the USB port, and I think you'll see this. Now, I didn't see this. I do use Windows 7, and we all have different setups, and I just didn't see it. But we did see down there that it had my, uh, you know, my phone plugged in and it was ready. So now fire up Odin. Let's go ahead and do that. Run, and now we have Odin. Let's see if I can just. There we go. All right. All right, now fire up Odin. Check boxes and version number are wrong in this image. That's fine, whatever. Okay, my COM port is eight. Yours might be different, just as Bad Sector says right down here. Your COM port might be different. If you see it, if you do not see a COM port number, then you did something wrong. All check boxes should be checked except for reset time and debug time. So undo that. Debug is off. One package is on. Um, all check boxes are off except for reset time and debug only, just as he said. All right, click the ops button and give it the transform ultra.ops file. And I guess it's going to open up automatically from whatever file Odin happens to be in, so I'll just go ahead and load that. All right. We'll be using the one package button from here on. All you need to do now is put the image you want to flash into one package, click the start button and pray it flashes properly. Alright, let's give that a shot. Um, one package. I have this uh, tu underscore cwm underscore recovery dot tar that I'm going to use. And double checking, measure twice, cut once, right? Um, click the start button. Alright, now we can see that's being done right here. Um, my phone just rebooted. Hopefully that's a good thing. Like I said, I've never done it before. Um, recovery image, down, uh, that image to download, finished, reset PDA, start a timer, close serial port, and wait until rebooting. All right, let's see what we got here. Oh, my phone's working. That's always a good sign, right? Let's go ahead and unplug it. As you can see, it's on, not broken. And turn it off. And boot back into CWM. Really hope I wasn't an idiot by, go ahead, by going ahead to unplug this before it was done, but you know, might just be the camera thing. All right, here we go. Camera, volume down, power, three finger. Oh wait, no, that's not what I want. I want CWM, don't I? All right, so volume down, power on. Hold volume down snugly, not too snugly. Someone has broken their uh, their volume down 
before, as we see in the forums. All right, Samsung logo, taking my finger off. I'm sorry, taking my finger off the power button, leaving it on the volume down button. All right, and I have CWM. All right, now with CWM you can do, like I said, quite a few things. Um, and uh, we'll make another video for that. All right, thank you very much. Have a good day. This has been Luda. Pleasure to serve.